What's up guys? Welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to cut this peach shag haircut. Uh, super excited to get started. We're going to be using the Tri Razor. This is the brand new tool that we came out with on Free Salon Education. So here we go. So the technique starts vertical right down center back and what we're going to do is we're going to swipe the razor just like you would swipe a credit card. It's super simple. I hold the hair straight out, swipe down and that's going to create a nice short layer at the top of that section and then it pulls a little bit of length towards the bottom of the section and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue bringing the hair straight out from the head straight towards me and swiping along that guideline. So you can see, take another vertical section, pull the hair straight back and you'll be able to see that guide right through the hair. I'm not pulling the hair over to it I'm just pulling it straight back and then you swipe down we're gonna continue doing this all the way through the back portion of this haircut So now just to kind of clean up the ends, I'll use the 100% cutting side on the tri razor and just hold the hair in my hands and cut a nice little blunt edge. It's keeping it nice and soft. You can see that buildup of weight that we have right at the top of the section. And now I'm gonna pull that crown diamond down and I'm gonna pull that straight out and just use a heavier stroke with the razor back and forth, which will create a nice layered effect on the hair. So now that we finished up the back section, all I want to do is just remove a little bit of weight. So I use the 50 texture side of the tri razor, go in there, just soften it up. Now the back's done. We're going to move into the front section. You can see I've sectioned it off into three. So we've got two sides and one top. The top's going to be the fringe. The sides are going to be kind of a face frame layered uh, part of the haircut. What I want to do is I want to create some disconnection. So you'll see me comb this hair back. Uh, slide my clip up in and then what I do is I break this section in half and I start cutting sort of a little fringe area But also just some short layers that are gonna pass through the side of the haircut and connect into the back So you can see swipe with the tri razor and then you'll see those layers kind of blend into that disconnect We're gonna cut that disconnect later. So don't worry about that. Just continue working through uh, Taking that section in half and then cutting those short layers throughout Alright, so now we've swiped all the way through. You can see those layers start to pop. Now there's a lot of length on there. So what are you going to do with that length? We're going to take the tri razor, 100% cutting, and we're just going to cut off the length and match it to the back side. And now look at those layers, how they pop, and then you see that disconnection kind of hang down. Uh, that's great for going in, styling, creating some really fun uh, texture within this cut. So now the fringe, this is really fun to cut. You just go in, you pull it all forward, and you work about a two inch pass up and down with the razor. And look how quick you can create a fringe using the tri razor. It's so cool. I uh, love it. If you guys want to pick up a tri razor, make sure you go to our shop, shopfse.com. They're on sale now, worldwide shipping available. Uh, and you're going to love it. So now just finish off that side, match up the two sides together. And now we've got our finished look. We're going to start with the blow dry using Paul Mitchell lift, work that through the hair, flat wrap the hair around using our Ergo paddle brush. And then uh, the final thing will be a little bit of round brushing, finish it off with an iron. Uh, and that's pretty much it. We're going to do a little bit of dry cutting. So I'll show you guys that and then you'll see the end result. So I'm using my Matt Beck scissor uh, to go through, just do a little bit of detail work, nothing too crazy, just like the, the ability to precisely go in and kind of separate some of that. But here's our end result. Hope you guys like it. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. We got videos coming out all of the time. And also, if you made it this far, make sure that you post right now in the comments, I made it. 
And then go to our store, Shop FSE, and use the code MADEIT at checkout, and you'll get 10% off your entire order of $100 or more. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Thanks.